Hi, this is Amit Verma with the Falcon Smart Technologies. I'm at the CTO at Falcon Smart. And today we're going to you know, walk you through some of the things that we're showcasing in the show LT North America today. Uh, what we're going to start out with is that what we basically are uh, calling innovation-led services. What that means is that how do you in employ you know, smarter tools and processes automation and infield and remote analytics to do your network services such as deployment, rollout, optimization and troubleshooting in a much smarter way. And the key is to do those smarter ways to how do you reduce 20 to 30% reduction in your cost and your cycle time. And uh, we're doing that not only for macro but also for uh, small cells and DAS and um, upcoming uh, you know, initiatives towards virtualization where if field testing is required then our tools will be pretty useful in that, in, in that space. Um, basically, you know, we are breaking our, the overall services space into site integration, site testing, and optimization, and leveraging the uh, Falcon Ops, which is the tool that we have to automate all the site-related work, such as uh, you know, site surveys, site walks, site packages, punch lists, and how do you do them in a smarter way so that the time from the data is collected, uh, is collected first time right, and is done in a way that is consistent and auditable, and, uh, and also the time it takes from information captured in the field to the time uh, it comes to the central office, that time needs to be reduced and centralized. And also, uh, it needs to be all cloud-based so that uh, there is a trackability and, and archiving, and whenever the information is required, it's easy to uh, get to. And you combine that with the automated site testing. Uh, with the automated site testing is where uh, uh, every time a site goes on, before site goes on air, we need to perform uh, certain sets of tests to ensure that the site is in good shape and is ready to go for cluster drive or, or to be launched in the market. And uh, this testing that is typically done uh, does require some degree of expertise and if not performed correctly could have more work during the cluster optimizations time because the sites were not properly tested. And our tool helps you reduce that cost almost by 35 to 40 percent. And also you can pretty much have the person who has the uh, very little or no RF knowledge, uh, almost an integration uh, person could be doing those testing and again that, that reduces the time, uh, the, the, the expense related to sending a separate team for doing those testing. And then last piece, we're talking about you know, optimization. Uh, in optimization, we break it down for macro, small cell, and DAS. And each one of them have uh, their own challenges. And how do you uh, deploy uh, smarter uh, ideas about, again, how do you reduce the cycle time? How do you reduce the cost? Uh, so for example, um, for macro, one of the features that we have is uh, live relay of complete uh, layer three RRC logs, as well as the scanner data. Uh, we're the only company that does it in a way that it does not interrupt the testing uh, that's being performed while you're driving, as well as, uh, uh, and, and, and at the same time, uh, all the data that is being collected is being simultaneously uploaded um, uh, to a centralized uh, server from there, uh, either manual or automatic root cause analysis can be performed. And this can again be a game changer in terms of reducing the number of drives required. So typically, you would collect the data and then post-process it and analyze it and then find out what's wrong, fix it and send somebody again to, uh, 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 to make sure the fixes were done properly. With our live uh, uh, RRC uh, capability and live scanner capability, uh, that can be all done in the same drive, uh, and which, is, which is a hugely uh, cost-saving element on the macro side. On the small cell and, and, and side, for example, we have a two, uh, you know, capability of what we call an automated functional call testing. It's very similar to what I talked about site testing for the macro, but take that to the small cell space. And in, in that space, each and every AP uh, needs to be tested, uh, both in terms of basic functional call testing, as well as in terms of the mobility testing and the handovers. And one of the things that becomes very, very interesting for small cell is the interference issues and how our tool can help um, uh, the functional call testing cycle to actually collect interference issues so that when the optimization engineers looks at it he already is aware of all the that data all those issues and can be fixed uh, in the first visit itself 
And uh, here what I'm going to now show you is our product, which is the, the flagship product. It's called Falcon Kit. Um, the Falcon Kit is a smart, uh, one of the early, uh, uh, we were one of the pioneers of this, this space where there's an all tablet based, all uh, UE based um, uh, solution. There are no wires hanging here. Uh, it's all um, untethered. And uh, the key uh, highlights of this product uh, are, I mean, you may find other products in the industry similar looking to this, but the key highlights here are, uh, number one, uh, it's one of the easiest to set up and easiest to uh, utilize kit in the market. The number two is that it allows up to 12 devices to be connected uh, to the kit, plus the scanner, and you can connect a DRT or PCTEL uh, Bluetooth scanner. Uh, we also, if you have a, a legacy scanner like MX or EX uh, from PCTEL, we support that as well. And why that's important that you have capability to go beyond six devices is again, if your configurations with the multi-layer technologies are calling for more than six devices to be tested, uh, you may end up either sending two teams or have the one team walk twice as much. So some of our customers are seeing you know, up to 30 to 40% cut down in, in their OPEX related to the data collection itself. And what's another thing that is very special about this kit is that it's one of the kits that, that actually combines data collection and, and report generation and analytics all on the same platform. And so once uh, the data is collected, um, you don't need to wait for a large amount of data to be uploaded to a centralized server for processing. This tablet right here can analyze it and actually generate a complete uh, report, finished report for you. So for example, again, going back to DAS, if you're doing a design activity and all you really need to do is RF survey, well, you can connect the tablet and scanner, walk the test, and then all your survey plots are going to come right out of the tablet. And here is an example of a report that, uh, that I was going to talk to you about. Now, this analytics that is done on the tablet are then even more advanced analytics are available on the cloud. And this is very, very unique in the sense that this is not a static report that you're looking at. Uh, uh, this is a, actually a modern uh, uh, visualization tool. It's based on Tableau. And uh, the benefit of it is that these uh, plots that you're looking at are not static images. They're actually uh, real um, dynamic plots and they can be drilled down. So if you have a drop call or bad coverage or bad signer area somewhere, uh, you'll be able to drill down right there and actually see it. So you're not dealing with a static finished image. And uh, all of this uh, uh, call out analytics has a platform which allows you to do what we call test lifecycle management. Uh, by test lifecycle management, what we mean is, you know, uh, everything you do before you start your test, everything you do during the test and after the test, all of that is managed by a centralized platform so that, you know, you have a before and after image, you have all your, administ you know, prep activities centralized and end of the day, your goal is to have first time right you know, first time yields needs to go up, cycle time needs to go down, and cost needs to go down. And so that's kind of a very brief, you know, uh, introduction. Uh, of course, there is a lot more to talk about, but, uh, you know, that hopefully that gives you a good overview.